Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, send redirect example. Uh, before you watch this video tutorial, please log into my channel and watch uh, send redirect introduction video tutorial. Then come and watch this tutorial so that you will understand this tutorial very clearly. Okay. Uh, here we can see how we can transfer control to the different domain. Okay. Suppose say I am in ndtv.com site. So from that I want to redirect to uh, google.com. So using send redirect it is possible. Okay. Uh, here you can see the web container. Uh, it has uh, custom search uh, servlet and down you can see the google uh, which is in another domain. So from custom search uh, servlet how we can uh, redirect the response to google.com uh, we can see now. Okay. Using uh, send redirect method we can uh, do it. Okay. So left side you can see the client browser. Uh, the client browser make uh, request to the custom search servlet. Uh, so from this custom search servlet, uh, we can uh, redirect the request to the google.com using the send redirect method. Okay. So this custom search servlet will make uh, send redirect uh, call to the google.com. Okay. Uh, so the response uh, reached to the client browser once we make uh, send redirect to the google.com so the response header will contains uh, two things okay uh, the first one is uh, status code which is 302 and another one is uh, location header which is the uh, uh, new url okay so in this case new url is uh, uh, www.google.com uh, okay so once uh, uh, client read that uh, 302 status code uh, it will understand. I have to redirect uh, request to the uh, new URL. So the new URL, uh, the client can get it from the uh, location header. Okay. So from the location header, it will take that new URL, which is nothing but uh, www.google.com, and it will make a new request to the uh, Google uh, website. Okay. So the uh, Google website uh, will uh, receive the request and process the request and uh, send the response back to the client. So, uh, to explain uh, send redirect, I have created the project called uh, send redirect demo. Okay. So in that project in web.xml, I have configured uh, the servlet called uh, my search servlet for the URL pattern search. Okay. I am opening uh, my search servlet.java. So the class uh, my search servlet extends HTTP servlet and it has uh, init method. This method will be called by the servlet container to initialize this uh, servlet and it has uh, do get method. Uh, this method is uh, called by the servlet container to process the get request. Here uh, what I am doing is I am getting the search key then uh, I am redirecting the request to uh, Google uh, site uh, by using uh, response dot uh, send redirect method and also uh, at the end I am passing the search key okay and it has uh, destroy method this method uh, will be called by the servlet container to remove this uh, servlet from the service okay I am going to deploy this uh, web application before that uh, I will compile this uh, project export clicking on var file and I am placing uh, the var file inside the tomcat uh, web apps folder. Okay. Uh, now I am going to start the server. And the server has been uh, started. Uh, now I am going to access the web application using this uh, URL. I am clicking on enter. So it is showing uh, index.html content. Index.html is nothing but a welcome page. Okay. I am opening uh, index.html in uh, Eclipse. It has uh, one link and uh, when you click that link, uh, it will open uh, mysearch.html. Uh, okay. I am clicking uh, my search uh, link. So it is opening uh, mysearch.html uh, uh, content. So mysearch.html uh, what it is there is uh, it has one uh, text box and uh, it has submit button. So once you click on this submit button uh, action is uh, search. Okay. 
so the request will uh, go to the server and the url pattern is uh, search okay so you are seeing uh, my search html content here you can uh, give uh, the search key and you can uh, click on uh, google search okay so before uh, typing something and click on google search i will uh, enable uh, web developer developer uh, toolbar okay so in this uh, text box i am typing uh, java and uh, clicking on uh, google search button uh, so the request uh, went to the google site okay so if you see this uh, first request so i am clicking on the first row in the right side uh, developer uh, toolbar so you can see uh, the first request url is uh, http localhost 8080 send redirect demo search and the search key is uh, java okay uh, so the server uh, received this request and the server will uh, forward the request to the servlet container so in this case uh, search is a url pattern so based on this uh, url pattern search uh, the servlet container will check in the web.xml okay so in web.xml uh, for the url pattern search we configured uh, my search servlet uh, so the servlet container will initialize this servlet then it will call the uh, do get method okay so in uh, do get method what we are doing is uh, we are uh, getting the search key so search key is nothing but uh, uh, java right and the value of uh, search key is uh, java so we will get uh, java here then uh, what uh, here we are doing is uh, we are redirecting the request to the google site uh, by the search key value okay so here search key value is uh, java okay so you can see it uh, redirect to google.com and the uh, search key value is uh, java so you can see here java and uh, java related uh, links are uh, coming here okay so if you see this uh, get request uh, clearly uh, it uh, returns status code 302 okay so meaning uh, once uh, client receive this uh, uh, response from the server uh, by status code uh, the client uh, knows okay i have to redirect the request to uh, some other uh, resource okay so the new resource location will be available in the uh, location header so that is what you are seeing here okay so what client will do is it will read this uh, location and uh, the client will redirect to the uh, new uh, location okay that is nothing but uh, google.co.in okay uh, here you can see the client has made a second request to the google site i am clicking that uh, second row so the google site uh, receive the request and process the request and uh, send the response back to the uh, client that is what you are seeing here okay and uh, this is how uh, send redirect works and uh, thanks for watching bye